Hey y'all, it's Day, and I'm here with a fall haul. For those of y'all who don't know, I live in the South, and if you live in the South, you already know our weather is like bipolar. So this haul is gonna be all over the place. I got long sleeves, short sleeves, long tops, jeans, booties, like, it's just gonna be all over the place. Um, I also wanted to include some comfortable shoes because I'm getting a little bit older and I just don't like wearing shoes that hurt my feet anymore and I just don't want to have like busted bangs in my legs and corns like I don't have any of that and I'm starting to see them on people that I know so I have comfy shoes sweaters crop tops jeans a little bit of everything in this haul since the fall weather is all over um also Fashion Nova I mentioned this in like my last video where I did Fashion Nova haul their stuff was slim pickings they actually have cute stuff for the fall so I got quite a bit of things today so let's get right into it so the first thing I have is like this collar dress shirt thing I don't know what to call it but I feel like this is super cute for the fall because the fabric on it is really really um what's the word the fabric is light but it's long so you can wear it on a day where the weather might flip up on you and I feel like it'll be accessorized well with like some nice little like platform sandals or with some cute little booties um I actually have some boots that match the little tan lines going in between so yeah that is the first top so next two tops like some basic t-shirts well I guess not really basic they're kind of long and then they have the split up the side um, so they have like a little bit of edge to them, but they're actually called the laid back tee And this is just for like days where I'm just running out and I just want to throw like a cute little top on um, But I've realized that all I have is like crop tops So <laughs> I need to buy some more long tops like long sleeve basic tops. So yeah, I got this in mustard and I also And I also got it in burgundy I actually wear these to work as well and throw like some jewelry on because I feel like you can kind of dress this up because it has that little split on the side it doesn't count as a t-shirt even though not allowed to wear t-shirts at work but I think I can get away with it nobody really says anything to me so the next top is this angel on fire top I just like how it's like a dress shirt like you can wear it with some pants like I have it right now with some leather pants or like a skirt or something but I love how the back is out and then you have the front with these long panels it was just really different and cute like it's real afro punk vibes to me but um I will say it's not for me with my girls it's not no bra friendly like um when I was trying it on I was having nip slips so I have to figure something out as far as getting the bra part to stay in place and making sure my nipples don't come out but I have tape and stuff for that and I will link um if I remember hopefully I remember I will link the nipple covers that I use which also give a little bit of a lift and I will link the tape that I use as well which is super strong tape like I'm, I'm like a C borderline D cup and I feel like my boobs are really heavy so it's really it's really good tape the only warning I have about it is I wouldn't wear it for extended periods of time because one time I did wear it for a really long time like all day like all day and when I peeled it off I felt like my skin was about to rip off like I don't know almost I don't know just don't wear it for a real long time but it's really good tape now the next thing i have are these faux leather pants they are called the chrissy faux leather pants and these are surprisingly comfortable like i didn't think i would want leather pants but i wanted the leather pants to go specifically with that top i just had on because i thought it would be cute to dress up in the fall but these pants are super comfortable like the inside is super soft it's got like that like sweat pant material um i wasn't expecting them to be that comfortable and they also have a really really good stretch i just wasn't expecting these other pants to fit so comfortably so i'm really satisfied with this purchase um the only thing i don't like is how it didn't where it buttons at in the front um there's like a little gap right there you can kind of see the skin but it's no big deal i'm i really like these so i'm definitely keeping them all right so next is my favorite thing that i got from this haul which is cargo pants if you watched my other video where i did the pretty little thing in fashion Nova haul you saw how excited i was to find cargo pants they were actually little people friendly because i can never get gar cargo pants because the waist will like come up to my boob or the legs will be all the way down past my feet and it, it was just too much so i did order these and i love them i love the little garter accents that is super cute and different to me my only complaint is that the waist is way too tight so i'm hoping that they loosen up um over time as i wear them but i'm keeping them real cute dress them up dress them down i'm excited about these and the next thing i have is the karina stripe joggers army print is really in style and it has been in style for i don't know 
a year or so now but i haven't really found anything that i like but when i saw these with a the little stripe on the side and then they have the cutout in the knee i was sold so i definitely got these they're really comfortable too so can't wait to wear those and the next bottom that i have are the, called the chain to your love jeans um i don't know how i feel about these jeans i like that they have the chain on them that's what made me get them but um i'm not really sold on the fit and I have a bunch of jeans that fit like this, so I might I might send these back. I'm not in love with them, um, so yeah, I'll probably send these back. And Fashion Nova has an easy return policy; uh, they'll just give you your um, give you store credit and keep it moving. And I order from them frequently, so I can just take the store credit and keep it moving. So the top that I've been wearing with these bottoms is the Sleek and Slay bodysuit. I really don't have much to say about it. Um, it's just a basic bodysuit. It is thonged, um, which is good because I can't stand bodysuits that aren't thonged. Like nobody wants a panty line showing, so I won't even buy them if they're not thonged. But yeah, real basic. I wish the straps were a little uh, adjustable with a little plastic thing, but they're not. But real basic and real no bra friendly. So the next thing I have is my second favorite thing from this haul, which are these jeans. They're called the Caught in Your Love Jeans. And what I really, really like about them is that the back are cut out like right underneath the butt cheek. It's perfect. Um, my only complaint, it took me five minutes to put these dang on jeans on because my foot kept getting caught in the little openings. And then when I got down to my heel, I don't know what happened. Like my foot just was like not trying to go through the bottom. But once I got them in, they fit good fit good i actually filmed the try on the day before and i ended up wearing those jeans all day i like how they actually loosen up during the day and they gave a good a really good comfortable fit so these have easily become one of my favorite jeans so y'all probably if you know me you'll see me wearing these jeans a lot because i like that you can dress them up and dress them down as well like now i have it on with this hold me close sweater it has a zipper in the front and i don't know if y'all can tell because i was looking and i can't really see it but it's like fluffy and i like fluffy stuff it's super cute and i love that it's off shoulder and it's zippered so i can like zipping it down if i want to show a little bit of cleavage it's i just really like this top at all it's giving me like old school clueless vibes and I love it. And then I can also wear the same jeans and it looks just as good with a more girly top. This, this is called the Sunshine Smile Crop Top and this is probably my third favorite thing out of this collection. I love this crop top. And it's perfect for the fall because the, the sweater material is very, very thin so you won't get hot. And I actually ended up wearing that, this top with those jeans when I went to a football game yesterday evening and it was it was hot during the day so it was like high 80s but then the temperatures dropped down to like i think like 71 and it was like the perfect perfect outfit because i wasn't too hot and i when the breeze hit i wasn't feeling cold so yeah and that's it as far as clothes go so i did get some shoes because like i said i'm looking for more comfortable shoes these days and i'm about to actually get rid of like all my stilettos and shoes that hurt my feet so the first thing I got was some black booties, of course, perfect for the fall and winter. They are called the nothing more than friend booties. And yeah, these are really comfortable. Like y'all can see it has a chunky heel, a little bit of peak toe action. So I felt like this was an essential for the fall. So next shoe that I have is this chunky mustard heel. And this shoe is comfortable. It has, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it has like a little padding right there where the arch would be probably can't see it but just take my word for it has a padding where the arch would be heel is chunky not high so it's not gonna hurt my feet i can walk in these and truck in these and do what i gotta do so i'm extra excited about these because i have a pair of mustard shoes that i got from fashion not fashion over um forever 21 like when i was in college and they the arch is too high like to the point where y'all when i tell y'all i don't wear shoes that hurt my feet anymore like i'll put those things on and if my foot like my achilles is too high up i'm like uh-uh take them off so i actually need to hit up my friends to see who got the same size shoes me because i have shoes that i barely even worn because i don't want to wear them no more because i just don't want my feet hurting no more like i'm just i'm just so over it like y'all feel me like we just get to an age you're like i'm tired of my feet hurting like you can be cute without hurting your feet all right, the next shoe is actually my favorite shoe. Unfortunately, they are a little bit too small, but honestly, I think I'm gonna keep them anyway. Uh, I probably need a half a size or a size up, but if they don't have them online for me to order um, a bigger size, I'm gonna keep these anyway. These shoes are so cute and they're comfortable. They have like this little like 
see-through, which I was so against having the little see-through uh, plastic over my toes because I don't want my toes to be like sweating and you can see the perspiration on top of the foot. But I'm hoping that don't happen because they're so open, like it has the pizza action and the, the top is open. But I thought these were so cute and I needed like a, a like classy black heel or black wedge. Like I have black wedges, but they're like chunky, bulky. They just doing a lot. So I was like, I need me a really simple one that can kind of give me like that sleek, classic stiletto look. But uh, these are perfect and I'm gonna go back and check. Hopefully they have them in a half a size or a size up and I'll swap them out. If not, I'm gonna keep them and hopefully nobody will catch my toes cat daddy and over the edge. Actually, it's not that bad. My big toes just kind of, just really on one foot because one of my feet is bigger than the other one. One of my foot, is it feet or foot? You have feet, one foot. Yeah, okay, one of my foot is bigger than the other foot and on that foot the toe is kind of peeking over a little bit and the heel is popping out because on the other foot it fits just fine so if they don't have it i'm gonna keep it and hopefully don't nobody be standing at my feet long or they catch the foot that's small so we'll see and that's it for the things that i got from fashion nova the other two pairs of shoes i posted these shoes on snapchat and everybody was like oh my god where'd you get them from so i was like let me include them in the video these shoes are so cute hold on so it's funny because y'all know how like when you're talking about something and it like an ad comes up for it on like facebook or instagram but you didn't search for it so that was kind of weird for me i was just telling my homegirl like i need some like she has like her sandal actually two of my homegirls their sandal collection is on point like they have the cutest dressed up but comfortable looking sandals with platforms i'm like i need some but whenever i go with them to go find it in like ross tj maxx or um, Charlotte Russe or whatever, I can never ever find them. And then I was like, well, let me check my regular, it's pretty little thing, and Fashion Nova, still couldn't find them. So yeah, next thing I know, they popped up on Instagram. Actually, it popped up on Facebook, and I kept scrolling, then it popped up on Instagram, and I'm like, this is witchcraft. It's witchcraft. Ended up clicking, and I found the cutest shoes. So the company is called Ego, and like I said, I found it on Instagram. I just took a risk. Um, I order all my stuff through PayPal, so if it does not come, I can just call PayPal, dispute the charge, and they handle the rest. So if you have a PayPal account or you don't have one, I highly recommend if you're doing a lot of online shopping, get PayPal. Because even when I've had mishaps with Fashion Nova in the past, where they didn't ship out my stuff, um, I just called PayPal, said I never got my stuff, and they literally handle the rest. At that point, with, with PayPal, it is the um, it's the seller's responsibility to prove that they shipped you the stuff. And if they don't do it within a certain amount of time, which is really quick, I think they only give them like five days, then you automatically get your money back and it's, it's on the seller. So I love shopping with PayPal, with my PayPal card. So, uh, like I said, this company's name is Ego. It's a United Kingdom company. Um, my first time buying from them and I was super pleased. The stuff came really quick. I was expecting my stuff to take like two weeks. It said five to seven um, business days for shipping, but I figured, okay, well processing is gonna be a this amount and just gotta go through customs or whatever, whatever. I got that stuff in, I wanna say six or seven days. So I'm really pleased with the shipment. So the first shoe that I have is called the Rebel. Rebel, what is it? It's like a Rebel, the Rebel sandal in nude. And it's just like a platform sandal. Um, on camera, these look really, really big on my feet, but they don't look like that in person. And I was trying to mess with the angle to make it not look big, but whatever. My feet, I'm only a size seven, so yeah. Um, oh, I will say, speaking of sizes, uh, with these, I probably would order them a half a size down. So I think my size seven foot, when you looked at their size chart, converted to like a five and a half or five. I don't know, I would just order a half a size down because I did feel like these were just a teeny bit um, too big. But yeah, I'm, I'm still gonna keep them. It wasn't that big of a difference. Like they, my foot still fits in the shoe. So yeah, I like these a lot. Got me some new sandals, pumps. I can dress these up if I'm going out to like whatever and I don't necessarily want to wear a heel but I want to wear a nice like classy shoe but don't want to wear like a sandal it's like a good segue between a sandal and a heel so love these the next shoe I've been wearing the heck out of these got them from ego um they don't have the name on the side but I will have everything linked in the description box but these suede sandals are so cute and these are flexible year round. I can wear these in the summer and I can wear these in the fall. I got them like a week ago and I've definitely worn them like at least four times. 
and I get so many compliments on them when I go out and they're so comfortable love these shoes super cute y'all and that concludes this haul so I don't have nothing to say to wrap it up. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe before you leave. And of course, let me know what your favorite piece was down in the comment section. Bye!